Ooh. How's everybody doing out there? This is Black Chaos of the D&D Gaming Group. Got a little mutt for you guys. Uh, promised you guys in my last video that I'll bring you some mutt. Uh, maybe it's a video. But anyway, as you can see, I'm going through my lineup. Nothing special. Overall rank 74. I got a couple of 80s. Look, oh, there's an 81 in the rear. I picked him up right before I went to this game. But pretty much nothing special. Just a lot of 80s. Trying try to get some money going, man. Trying to get some points. You see, I only got $1,600. But I got my first win. Let's see if we can get a win. It's week two. I'm always afraid going into these muck games that someone's going to have, like, some outstanding teams. But I sent some quick blitz, a quick blitz on this guy right here, man. Get some pressure. Then I sent a dual edge on this guy. Get some pressure. Let's see if we can spook this guy early, man. I don't know how he got that off. I don't know how he got that off. But anyway, look at these muck teams, man. And, you know, get that superstar running back and maybe somebody... I know they're trying to match you up with uh, kind of close to what you got as far as skill level on your team or whatever. So I'm supposedly supposed to match up with someone that's close to 74. But, uh, we'll see, man. I, I'm still learning how to do this much. Look at these blocks. Look at these blocks. I'm still learning how to do this much, man. I got Emma Smith at running back. I had the regrowth, too. I don't know. I, I lost it. I don't know how he got injured and never came back. I don't I think I messed that up. But anyway, look at this dumb play by me right here. I got Joe Montana at quarterback. The biggest brain fart ever. No one was open. I should have just threw that ball away. But again, making stupid mistakes. And then I get sacked again right here. 4 32. So if I play it smart, man, I punch the guy the ball. So this this Hopkins guy he had, man. He was using him pretty good. Man. He kept on these slant routes with his running back, man. He put the running back like out of the receiver and he slant him in. Right, I get the UFC. Got your ass, brother. Got your ass, man. Made a pickup, man. Greer, I put him over there. And, um, you know, he, he's turned out to be decent in this game. I need to see if I can get some more money, man, and, and, and possible players. Get the, the touchdown with Emmitt Smith right there. Emmitt Smith is not that fast. Man. And right here, I got his brother's ass again, man. And that's that pickup I made, Greer. So, I got to use a pick with him right there. And so, it's 7-7, seven, seven, man. What do you guys think about the All-Star Game, man? Did anybody check out the All-Star Game as far as the dunks? The All-Star Game to me is just becoming... It's not even... I'm missing it. The All-Star Game is just not interesting to me. I watched that All-Star Game. I watched bits and pieces of it. I didn't even watch any of the dunk contests. To me, the dunk contest is... It's overrated, man. It's, it's too controlled. You know, back in the day when... Jordan and Kobe Bryant were doing dunk contests and was kind of, you know, they did their own thing. Right now, it seems like so many things are written and you, you got to do this, you got to do that, and just the creativity anymore is just not there. It's, to me, to me, it's just not there anymore, man. I, I, I saw one dunk where, I guess, uh, John Wall, man, won it, but to me, I mean, that wasn't an uh, amazing dunk, man. These guys can jump out of the gym anyway. That's one of the reasons I think LeBron James never competes in the dunk contest because, in my opinion, every dunk that I've seen LeBron James do is nothing that. If I could jump that high, I'd probably do the same thing. I'd probably dunk over people, but it's nothing like a Vince Carter. When Vince Carter did the dunk contest, you saw things that you never even thought of. You know, around the back, 360, bounce in between the legs, 360. I mean, that dude was doing crazy stuff, man. That was the best dunk contest I think we've seen since, you know, back in the day, maybe when Jordan won it. But other than that, man, it's just, you jump from the free throw line, and you jump over somebody. How many people are going to jump over somebody? I mean, seriously. We had Blake Griffin jump over a car. Everybody dunk contest jumps over somebody. If you're in the NBA, and you're, you're seven feet, close to seven feet, I would expect you to be able to jump over somebody. That's just my feeling on the NBA, man. I can't dunk the basketball. But anyway, getting back to this game, man. It's 28-14. Man, this guy's hitting up this Hopkins guy. He hit him. He kept hitting me on it. It was and maybe like an inside route that he was swerved to the outside, man. But, and then right here, Davis gets a pick, man. Love when the computer gets a pick. It's I know it surprised him because it, it surprised me. But right here, this guy gets upset, man. He gives me those points for free. I guess in this way, it's coin, man. Give me those points for free. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Make sure to check out the rest of the D&D game.